31 week preaching series seems like a long preaching series, at least it does to me and in the culture of Shoreline Church where I pastor, 31 weeks would be the longest series they'd ever done by about four or five times. So when I saw the story and thought about doing it as a preaching series, I had to think that through. And what we came up with was, why not break it down into six bite-sized portions, six mini-series within the whole 31-week story experience? Here's what we came up with. Our first series was called Hope in the Darkness, looking at the Pentateuch. The second series, Victory Against All Odds, looking at Joshua, Judges, and Ruth. The third series we had a blast with. We kind of went with a Western theme, and we called it The Good, The Bad, and The Ugly, looking at the time of the kings of Israel. Right now we're in a series called God is Speaking, Are We Listening? Looking at the prophets of Israel. We're going to then take a little summer break. When we come back from the summer, we'll get into the New Testament. We'll have a mini-series called The Man with the Plan, looking at the Gospels and the life of Jesus. And we'll finish up with a series called Under Construction, looking at the church from Acts, the Epistles, and then the book of Revelation. We found for us a 31-week series in preaching was too long, but six mini-series really worked. So what we provided for you, and you'll see it at the end of this little video here, is a Vimeo page where you can go and check out the preaching of some of these series, and also a website where you can go and download a copy of our whole year preaching schedule with all the titling, if that would be helpful for you. I encourage you to do the story, whether it's as a 31-week series or six little mini-series.